and then <clears throat> that's what we're doing this one side of what would work for um for a foyer or or the side table okay and the trick is we're going to make a spider web using the hot glue gun most of you have a hot glue gun and you just melt it on a stack of old styrofoam just the green styrofoam let me get I want to put a good bit of glue on there be real careful though because this is blister you in a minute you want it to kind of start bubbling I don't know if you can see it bubbling there and then you just get, put your styrofoam together and it'll melt and then you just start making your spider webs all over your arrangement you could do this around most anything to give it that spooky look for Halloween. Then we're going to add a little spider right here in the branches. And say if we were doing this on a buffet table, let's add the little witch to it for Halloween. Little eyes might get on your nerves after a little bit but um but she's a lot of fun for halloween i'm going to show you a few other things for door pieces let's cut her off How'd you do? <laughs> <laughs> i don't know <laughs> this time of year in south georgia mm. right on your throat okay mm -hmm. that then, looks great you like that where's the where did the noise come from the little sound uh-huh you didn't you missed her <laughs> Way the cop. Okay. She uh, she's run by batteries. That's great. And she just so goes just back and forth. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you need a door piece, we've got the little um, cute? foam. It's just real funny. And I love it when you put all this together. Yeah. You had a spider somewhere, did you put the spider uh -huh. up in there? Right up there. Oh, there right you up there. Oh, okay. And we've got the what little else? Halloween trees mm -hmm. that have the little ornaments. That's a real reasonable little item mm -hmm. there. Like you could get it out mm -hmm. every year. And then we've got the little candles and mm -hmm. the little water balls. Mm -hmm. And then there's a little scarecrow over there. I don't know if they've shown him yet or not. And then we've got any time the, of year, the, <clears throat> the pretty all the fall. Uh, fall uh, and so many of the silk flowers have that dried look. That's mm -hmm. real popular right now. Okay. So. It's just a little Wonderful. bit of what we got Pretty for, stuff. I'm for Thank you Thank from you. the Flower Gazebo. Check them out. Go check with your florist. We're going to take a break. Back in just a second. More after this. Futon is here. Sasa's Mattress Factory and Sleep Center brings from the Orient to Albany the most versatile and practical way to furnish your home. Futon Furniture. All cotton, long-lasting bedding and cushions with many styles of frames and a wide selection of washable and interchangeable covers. That's one way to describe Futon Furniture. Another is affordable. Stop by Sasa's at 937 West Broad Avenue and let Donnie Sasa and his staff introduce you to Futon Furniture. How long has it been since you had your eyes examined? Doctors recommend an every year. Hurry to Horner Roush Optical this month for a very special limited time offer. A free eye exam with the purchase of complete eyeglasses. Just bring in the eye exam bill from any doctor or visit the optometrist located in store. Horner Roush will give you up to $34 credit on your purchase of eyeglasses. This month only at Horner Roush Superstore in Valdosta Mall and Albany Mall. See history come to life at the 18th Annual Andersonville Historic Fair, October 2nd and 3rd in the Civil War Village of Andersonville, with two large-scale realistic battle reenactments and activities scheduled from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. October 2nd and 3rd. The kickoff parade is Saturday at 11 a.m. and features famous Civil War notables, plus 200 dealers and antiques, Civil War collectibles, arts and crafts. Tickets are $3 for adults, $1 for children. Sponsored by the Andersonville Guild. All proceeds go to historic preservation. We are back. You can hear some of the best music this weekend in Moultrie, Georgia, as they gear up to their first annual Main Street Music Festival. Mr. West Hawkins with me today. He is a member of Room 19. If that's a, an unusual name for a group, well, it has a story behind it. If we have time, we'll share that story with all of you. But they're going to be one of the groups performing. We'll get to hear some of his music in just a moment. 
Melissa Spells and Mike Lively are both with me today on behalf of Cockwood County High School. They are both members of the Drama Club hosting some of the events this weekend. Connie Fritz is along today on behalf of the Main Street Music Festival Committee. We'll give an information phone number in just a few moments if you can call for all the details for the whole weekend. It's good to have all of you here. Thank Thanks you. Thanks for being on today. Connie, this is a first for the city of Moultrie. You've done so much with your performing arts and your cultural center there, so I guess you decided just to take it to the streets instead of one well, place. Maybe? Years ago, Colquitt County is a big tobacco area, and years ago they used to have a big tobacco festival down on the square mm -hmm. um, at the end of tobacco season. They kind of got away from that, so this is an updated version, so to speak. Yeah. Um, it's just an opportunity for folks to come down on the square, bring a blanket, bring their lawn chairs, and just sit and enjoy the music. Is it strictly just music or drama as well? It's just music, and local artists will have some of their artwork displayed in some of the um, <coughs> stores around town. The Drama Club is responsible for uh, the Sidewalk Cafe, which will offer uh, okay. lunch plates. For some everyone. folks are wondering why you're dressed the way you are. You don't <laughs> usually go to school like this. No, no, no. No, you don't. But it'll be a lot of fun. Both of you are members of the Drama Club. Have you, you, both of you are seniors. Have you been a part of the Drama Club since you've been in high school or not? All three years I have. <laughs> have you? Yes, ma'am. I'm the president of the club. Okay. Secretary of the club. And Secretary. I've only been at the high school for two years, but I was very active last year and plan to be this year. Okay, and you're going to be wedding tables and serving tomorrow during the music. Yes, we will all be in a different character, all dressed up and, and, oh, yes. and yeah. different accents okay. and stuff like that. Yeah, Quite the, different. In the <laughs> club, you gotta, you got to act. Oh, yeah. That's right. Okay, it's going to be a lot of fun. You're going to be singing. Yes. Along with the group. I say group. Is it more than just yourself? I believe there's about uh, 12 bands, or isn't there? All 12 together? different bands all together, yes. Mm -hmm. kind of music are you going to be doing? We're going to get to hear some too, right? Yeah, Today? sure, sure. We play, uh, my band plays uh, blues and rock and roll and that sort of thing. And uh, I think there'll be some bands that are playing country as well and a lot of rock yeah, and roll. Yeah, so, so kind of different types of music for all tastes, all right, depending on what you really like, I guess. There should be something there for everyone. We've got country and rock and we've got gospel, um, bluegrass, mm -hmm. and some progressives. So we're really excited about the mix. Well, uh, can we hear something? Sure, sure. Glad to get sure. there. What just are you going to have this Yeah, you just happen <laughs> to have it behind you. You take it wherever uh, you go, right? together my friend living our dreams oh you're on top my mind is aching lord it won't stop that's how it happens living life by the drop Good to be here walking together, my friend. 